Here we are about to end 2020 and some of you are like, finally. Uh, and yet, what really changes as we go into a new year except for the calendar? There's still so much going on in our world. There's, there's so many hard times going on. So many of you are in a season of struggling with your family. Uh, maybe it's health, maybe it's relationships, maybe it's finances. And yet, our God is a God of hope. And we know, we believe with everything in us that we're seeing his hope transform our cities one story at a time. And you're a part of that. And I'm a part of that. And as a church, we get to be a part of that together. And together, I believe, we're able to see God do more than we would ever see him do if we're all isolated individuals. So as the pastor of Hillside, at the end of this year, I just want to take a moment and say thank you so much for your prayers. Thank you so much for serving. Thank you so much for your generosity also. It's because of your prayers, your service, and your generosity that we're able to be a part of the ministry of joining God in his work of transformation here in places like Rancho Cucamonga in the Inland Empire and to the ends of the earth in places like India and Kenya and Mexico. Thank you so much. And if you haven't done so already, I want to ask you to prayerfully consider how can you be a part of our year-end giving. We've called it a time of trust and transformation because we want to be a part of transformation right here, right now that launches us into a new year. And it's a tax deductible gift for you and your family. But to prayerfully consider God how can I be a part of that and give generously and give sacrificially and not miss out on this moment, but join together with many others to see God do what only he can do? Would you pray with me in this moment? God, thank you so much for your faithfulness. Uh, I know there's uh, women and men and girls and boys listening to me right now that are in the midst of a very, very, very difficult season. God, we know that we have uh, frontline workers, police, fire, nurses, doctors, essential workers of all kinds in the middle of a battle. God, protect them. God, watch over them, we pray. God, we pray that even as we end a year that we would just get a glimpse of your faithfulness and of your grace. And I pray that we would also be able to step in faith in generosity and join together with each other to see you do, God, what only you can do. It's in Jesus' name we pray. Amen.